obviously, <laughs> I think it's pretty obvious, I'm going to be teaching you how to change a nappy. <laughs> okay. It's a skill you're going to want to pick up very quickly, if you're going to use it in the future. You want to get it right the first time. <laughs> um, <laughs> definitely. Um, the objectives I'm going to cover are the importance of getting it right. <laughs> Um, the skill itself of actually nappy changing and the health and safety behind changing a nappy. Mm -hmm. okay. So the importance of getting it right is <laughs> to prevent leakages, obviously, and <laughs> this could end fatally. <laughs> <laughs> Not really good. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> um, so very important to get it right. And um, also to prevent any discomfort for the baby it's on the head. It's <laughs> very important to get the right end. <laughs> Health and safety. The main things are to wash your hands before changing a nappy and definitely after changing a nappy. Position of your baby is very important to make sure that they're left on their back and not trying to call out the room or, <laughs> or any other fancy position they might try and take. Um, it's always important to change your baby on either a safe changing table itself or um, on a safe surface like the floor but with a changing mat or um, pad underneath. It is also very important to dispose of soiled nappies <laughs> in the right containers and properly. But before I demonstrate, has anybody changed a nappy before? Yes. Yes. Okay. So everybody in the room? Great. <laughs> okay. Um, what were your first experiences of changing nappies? Were they good experiences? Did you find them quite easy? No. I didn't tuck it down. Apparently, <laughs> <laughs> this is key with boys. Yes. <laughs> I was going to say, clearly a boy. <laughs> your baby or somebody else's baby? My, my nephew. Okay. So he got you. Yeah. The <laughs> 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 So important to so tucking certain things in. <laughs> Um, I think just trying to get the size of the baby and the size of the nappy right mm -hmm. for a start, because otherwise it's not going to work. Yeah, key. <laughs> yeah. yeah, well, uh, I used, um, what were they called? Terry Town. Yeah, Terry Town, yeah. Terry Town, yeah. Terry Town, yeah. Terry Town, yeah. So, so that was... More complex. That was yeah. trying to, I can't remember how to do it, but you had to fold it a certain yeah. way. Um, Are you a pro? Yeah. <laughs> but, um, Have you changed disposable nappies though for us? Well? I have. Yes. <laughs> I think what the problem with that was. I thought it went fairly well. <laughs> the sticky bits, right? Uh, yeah. yeah. Otherwise, they, you know, it, it all gets too loose. So, yeah. Yeah. It's just that fighting with them. Just yeah, just when they're them. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> them. Stop them wriggling round. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. And I ride. Yes. 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 No, because I had two girls first and then I had a boy. And oh. Like, oh my word. <laughs> I thought I got it all sussed. Yeah, yeah. Come on, boys! Like, whoa, 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 what's that? Very different. Yes. Okay, I have got some handouts for you. Let me pass them around. Thank you. These are the tools you will need to change nothing. Thank you. Oh, sorry. Sorry, I left you Out, I would then fold it back in on itself and put it in the bag. 
then. It's up to you when you tie your bag. If your baby's urgently wiggling around and you want to come back to your bag later, you can. But yeah, make sure it's tied up properly so no smells get out, because that's not fun. Then you have your other nappy ready. Make sure, tabs down, <laughs> go underneath the bottom of your baby. Most importantly, make sure your flaps, your flaps are out on the sides, again, to prevent any leakages. And then bring your nappy over, make sure it's comfy. And again, bring your tabs to the middle. Again, making sure all your flaps are out on either side. And it's up to you whether you want to fold the top over. Everyone's different. You can do if it's a bit more comfy for them, depending on the size of your baby. I also make sure that they can breathe. Maybe slip two fingers so that you know that they've got breathable air. Again, make sure all your little flaps are out. And that is your baby change. Then make sure you wash your hands. That is the demonstration over. And now you can all... <laughs> Get on with your play. No, <laughs> See, what normally ends up happening is that like, poo on my hands. <laughs> yes. Poo on the baby changing <laughs> bag. <laughs> Maybe after today that will not happen again. <laughs> No, it's smelly at this stage, and you do want to. <laughs> <laughs> We've all got different size babies. Size. No smells. Yeah. How did we find that? Very, very good. Very good. Yeah. 